Happy Wednesday, sweet second graders. It's Mrs. Coslow here, and it was so fun getting to see some of your parents in our Zoom meeting last night at Back to School Night. Um, let's learn about what we're going to do today. Now, you might have to come back and watch this video again if you're not sure about one of your assignments once part of your learning, which is totally fine. Um, first, you get to do something silly. Uh, yesterday, we learned that the poem Invitation comes from the book Where the Sidewalk Ends by Shel Silverstein. Uh, today, you're going to read Invitation to Your Refrigerator. So you might want to do that a few times because we're really going to try and start to memorize it. And that means learn it um, in our heads without looking at the words. So do the best you can, and I hope your refrigerator enjoys it. In our second grade handwriting book, you guys are going to be doing letter S, which means it's going to be a small curve and then you curve back around the other way. We're working on our lowercase letters. These should be small and it should start at the dot. Take your time, please. And always feel free to circle your best one, your best S. Okay, next you're going to watch a video by my own daughter, Ella. And Ella was in Mrs. Sweeney's class last year, so she knows all about second grade. Now, you guys are gonna be creating your own backpack, and it's going to look like this. So you are going to take the green paper and cut it out. This is gonna be the back of the backpack. Then you're going to cut out the top part that says who the backpack belongs to and glue it at the top. The yellow part you're going to glue at the bottom, it's going to be like a pocket. Now, be very careful, boys and girls, okay? You want to make sure when you're gluing the yellow part, you only glue the outside part to the green paper. So that means when you are gluing down the yellow part, you're going to put glue around the outside because we don't want the inside to stick to the green paper. We only want this part to stick. So when you're gluing it on, only put glue on the outside, not at the top, because that's going to be our pocket part. And inside is going to go our writing. This is in the pocket of our backpack. What a second grader needs to be successful. So Ella is going to tell you what she thinks a second grader needs to be successful. And then you're going to write your own sentences on what you think a second grader needs to be successful. I said, I need to be a good listener, kind, and try my best. I also will push myself to read and write for longer times. That's called stamina. So that's what a second grader I think needs to be successful. Since this yellow part is a pocket in our backpack, I stick it in there. Pretty cool. I even chose to really make this my own by decorating my backpack if I have time, or if you have time. And I wrote second grade is sweet, and of course I have donuts on there. So, cutting out the green paper, gluing on who it belongs to, cutting this part out to do your writing, and only gluing on the bottom around the edge. No glue right here to create a pocket. Okay, math, you're gonna be working on our friends of 10. 10 counters on my frame, on my frame. 10 counters on my frame, on my frame. Nine and one and eight and two. Seven, three, six and four, five and five. So as I'm singing it, I can hear all the different ways to make 10. Nine and one and eight and two, seven, three, six and four, five and five. Um, you guys, this will help you sing the song so that you remember all the different ways to make 10. So I can go back to my song and think about nine and one and eight and two, seven, three. Oh, so I know that this seven needs a three next to it to add to it to make 10. So the song helps me and I can sing it over and over in my head to help me fill in the missing friends of 10 here. Okay, the next page, 
you are going to color different ways to make 10. So I know that nine and one is a way to make 10 on my 10 frame. So I would color nine of these in blue and maybe one of them in red. And then I'd write a number sentence to match. Nine and one make 10. Ooh, now I have to think of different ways. Now, don't forget, you could also switch it and say one and nine make 10. So you can do a switcheroo with the numbers to think of another way to make 10. Don't forget that. So you have two pages of math today. And then you also have PE today with Mr. Taylor. So don't forget about PE. Make sure you're wearing some good shoes in case you're doing some movement, some jumping, some running around. Okay, so friends, I hope you have a wonderful day. I'll see you at our quick check-in today at 10 o'clock. A little different, not 9 o'clock, because teachers here are all in meetings on Wednesdays. So it'll be at 10 o'clock. And um, I, you guys can ask me questions then about the backpack or about any other assignments that you weren't sure of. But you can also watch this video again, and you might find some answers. Okay. See you guys soon. Have a good morning.